All right, guys, good evening. We're coming to you from San Diego, California. We are gonna do the San Diego Seven Bridges Walk. It's a 5.5 mile walk, loop trail, it goes across seven of the most famous bridges here in the San Diego area. Some are pedestrian bridges, some are bridges that are made for vehicular traffic, but I'm gonna walk across all of them. Come and join me on this journey. Let's go make some memories. So this is the Quince Street Bridge. Quince Street. Part of the Seven Bridge hike here in San Diego. We're gonna hike across all seven of these bridges. I'm gonna walk across them and then walk back. side it's a little uphill and then up the steps see what the view looks like over here on the other side housing development and see there's no signs of any kind letting you know that that bridge is here it's just if you look up the seven step seven bridges of san diego like we did there's a website that has a map and has details about each bridge let's go back across the quint street bridge here so you can see this one is not made for vehicular traffic. This is just a footbridge only. It's made to cross this ravine that's down here. It's made for us. There's also a path that goes through here, through the ravine down at the bottom. You can see there's a gentleman over there walking a dog. But that's what this bridge is for, is to cross this ravine so you can get from one side of Quint Street to the next. So this is our first bridge that we're doing here. Up we go and up the steps we go and we'll have completed our first bridge. All right, we made it. All right, see you at the next one. Right behind me back here is Quince Street. So now I'm walking, this is First Avenue. I am walking across the First Avenue bridge. This is bridge number two. I'm gonna walk it in this direction. I'll show you the Quinn Street Bridge that we just did. That was bridge number one. I'll show you where that's located. You can see it from up here. But I'm gonna walk this way, cross the bridge, and then walk back the other way. Give you the views of the bridge and from everything from both sides. This is the ravine, the hiking trail down here. It's the same ravine that the Quinn Street Bridge goes over. It's just a different side because it kind of curves a little bit. See that white bridge? That's the Quint Street Bridge that we just walked across. That was bridge number one. The good thing is I'm getting plenty of exercise doing this for you guys. I'm trying to do 10,000 steps a day. I know I've mentioned it in a few of my vlogs. I'm trying to do 10,000 steps a day and I'm already over 11,000. It's only afternoon, so I may hit 20,000 today, which is good. All right, we made it. This is the view looking back the opposite way. As soon as the car traffic clears here, we're gonna hop across the street and walk back on the other side. Here's a good view down here. If you see down here, here's that trail that goes through the ravine. You see another tra trail of some sort over there, and then there's some steps over this way. And then there's some more steps down here. I don't know if that's people's private property, if I had to guess, I would say yes, it is, because it looks like it's gated in. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this vlog. I know it's just kind of me walking, me walking and talking, but I thought it was an interesting idea to hit up these seven bridges and make a vlog about it. Wow, look at the flowers on this right here. It's huge. Wow. And then here's the sign I was talking about. The First Avenue Bridge. 463 feet in length 104 feet in height that's it it says erected 1911 we're here at the corner of front and spruce going across bridge number three which is the spruce street suspension bridge while you're here if you're only able to do one or two of the bridges this is definitely one of the ones you have to do this is definitely the one that you'll see the most of if you google 
the seven bridges of San Diego, this is the one that always comes up the most. And this bridge was put up in 1912, so it is 109 years old. This is what the view looks like going down there. All right, let's go across it. This is the view off to the side. View down on the one side, and I'm looking the other way. This is your view. Yeah, this is definitely the the coolest of the bridges. And the suspension bridge moves; it wobbles back and forth as people walk. I don't know how well that shows on the camera, but I've got about five people walking behind me, and it's definitely moving now. It wasn't too much before, but it's moving a little bit more now. It doesn't bother me any, but. And then I like the way at the end here that the trees kind of come together. It almost makes a little type of a tunnel type entrance, I guess. How you doing? All right. So it looks like we just about made it to the end. This is what the view looks like from this end, which is Brant and Spruce Street. And then heading back down this way, back down the bridge. I just like the way this looks. I know I mentioned it going the other way, but I like the way the trees and bushes have come together here. It's very pretty. And it just opens up wide here to the canyon. When I get out here more a little bit in the middle, I'll give you a little panorama. But yeah, so here's what the view looks like. There's the bridge. And that's the full 360. We made it to the end of bridge number three. We will see you at the next one. We made it to bridge number four here, which is the Vermont Street Bridge. This bridge is going across some sort of highway here. Not quite sure where. This is our fourth one. All right, so we almost made it to the end here of the Vermont Street Bridge, which is just off of Vermont and University in San Diego just to kind of give you a heads up as to where it's at there's very limited parking at the end of Vermont Street it's, it's tough to find a parking spot you're almost better off coming into this neighborhood here all right this says poetry is not only dream and vision it is a skeleton architecture of our lives it lays the foundations for a future of change a bridge across our fears of what has never been before. And here's what the bridge looks like. And then off we go back across it. We're heading back now towards University. You see there's all kinds of sayings here on the wall, which is really nice. Every so often there's something there. There's this, it's a Navajo chant. It says, with lively feelings, may I walk? Being as it used to be long ago, may I walk? So just up here on the side. Hi. 
And this here says every man must choose whether he will walk in the light of creative altruism or the darkness of destructive selfishness, which is a quote from Martin Luther King Jr. This says I am thankful that I wear sensible shoes and can walk with comfort all day long. That's a lesson for everybody. Wear comfortable shoes. Right now I'm wearing very comfortable shoes so my feet aren't hurting at all and I've already walked a ton today. And this is only bridge number four. I still got a long way to go. And here's another one last quote. It says you must do the thing that you must do the thing that you think you cannot do, which is a quote from Eleanor Roosevelt. Alright, so that's the end of the Vermont Street Bridge. Man, somebody behind me is about to run me over. Alright, this is bridge number five. This is the Georgia Street Bridge, which is by far the tiniest, as you can see here. It's so small. And it goes over University. It goes over that way. And it goes over that way. And then this is the Georgia Street Bridge. Oh, All right, so walking across our sixth bridge here. This is in Balboa Park. This is one of our seven San Diego bridges. And this one is the one that goes over the roadway here in Balboa Park. And it takes you across to the Rose Garden down here. Very beautiful Rose Garden too. Alright, we've almost made it to the end here. Look at the views out in the distance. Look at the views out there. It's gorgeous. Alright, let's finish off this bridge. Alright, we made it to the end of the bridge. So this is heading back away from the Cactus and Rose Garden of Balboa Park. Now we're heading back into the main central area where the majority of the museums are located as well as the Children's Science Center and the Oregon Pavilion are all in this direction here. All right, we made it to the end of our bridge number six. We made it to our seventh and final bridge here on the Seven Bridges of San Diego Walk, the 5.5 mile loop. This is our final bridge. And it's located here by the archway entrance to Balboa Park. Let's take a stroll across this bridge. That's your view down. I'm sure you can hear all of the car traffic which you will see the cars here shortly when I get out into the center of the bridge. Now we're getting up onto the really high part of the bridge. You see there's several people out for jogs here this morning, out for walks. And here's our view looking down onto the traffic. Back onto the bridge. going by. <laughs> Jesus. Guys that just flew by on the scooter, they're just wiped out into his friend. There's lots of those scooters around San Diego. It makes for a good way to get around town, but a lot of people use them as toys. And we're not toys. Alright guys, we're just about here to the end of the bridge. And you know what happens when you get to the end? We gotta turn around and go back the other way. Now we're heading back towards the archway entrance to Balboa Park. And thank you guys so much for taking these the stroll across all seven of these bridges of San Diego hope you guys have enjoyed watching this I definitely had a good time making it good exercise good weather 
and seven cool uniquely different bridges to go across and check out. This basically is going to finish off this vlog. This was the San Diego seven bridge, 5.5 mile hike. All right. Thank you guys for watching us. I hope you guys enjoyed taking a stroll with me along the seven bridges of San Diego. I hope you guys like this. If you're subscribed to the channel, thank you very much for continuing to watch. If you're not subscribed, hit that button right down there. It's red. It says subscribe. Hit that button. You want to continue to grow. If you like this video, you want to see me do, do more hiking, exploration type videos in other cities, hit that thumbs up button. Hit that like button. Let us know that you like this and enjoyed it. Leave us a comment down below. Have you ever gone across any of the seven San Diego bridges? Maybe you've done all seven. Let me know which one's your favorite. I would say my favorite is the Spruce Street Suspension Bridge. Thank you guys so much for watching. And we will see you soon. All right, guys. We just finished our seven bridge hike. And here in Balboa Park, as we're heading back towards the Oregon Pavilion to head to the car, is this the bonus bridge? Is this bridge number eight that I'm walking across? Is this some bonus footage for you guys? It appears that way. But the cool thing is I've seen this before, so that's why I'm taking you guys back here on this little bonus trip. Look at this tree. Look at this tree right here. Are you guys ready for it? Check this tree out. Look at the roots of this thing. What color is your car? Look at that. All right, guys. Thanks for watching the bonus footage. Thanks for coming with me on the seven bridge slash bonus footage, maybe seven and a half bridge hike. Thanks for coming with me on it. Appreciate you guys watching. Love you guys that you watch. All right, see you down the road. See you soon.